Welcome to the third lesson of this short series. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to add the functionality to remove the unwanted characters like the dollar sign, like all these quotation marks. You see, when I try typing in them, they are stripped off. Okay, so that's what we are going to deal with right now. So, how we are going to do that? We are going to go back to this event where the user is typing in and what I did is I created an array and called it bad characters and this is how and I am using the regular expressions so that's an array and in here I add a regular expression maybe that's the character I don't want and I add the flag G and I that means it should check everywhere in the string and also not case sensitive so that's how I added them okay if I wanted to add another one like the add symbol I add it that way G I that's the flag another one now you may find that others like the plus will give you an error so how you you do that is you escape it using the backslash that way you escape it that will apply for the plus and the brackets and some others so you may escape them that way okay like when you want to put the bracket there it will give you an error you can see it's underlining it so you will escape it okay that way that's how I created the array so I'm going to type in all the special characters then we'll continue from there so I've gone ahead to type in all the unwanted characters I've, I've gone through the whole keyboard you can see that's an equal sign that's the carrot sign have typed in all of them so we can now use a function to remove these characters from the username okay so this is going to be so simple it's only one line of code now I'm going to use a loop a for loop but this is a special type of a for loop it's called a for in loop so for var i in bad chars you see we are using for var i in this is also available in javascript if you need you can go and search it but what it's just doing it's saying you should loop for every spe every regular expression in that okay so for that we are going to make the username dot value to be the username dot value dot now this is where we bring in the, the the method that does it dot replace dot replace this but chars the i and we're going to replace it with an empty string like that so you can see we're just using the username then we're using a function this is a is a, is a method available for all the strings and it uses a regular expression or a string there to search and what you are replacing it with in this case it's in a loop so we're going to use the this i has a key for that array and it will replace them okay just that so let's save the document and test it we are back to the browser now let's refresh so when i start typing my name it's okay but when i try to put special characters watch what happens it will strip them even if you hold them it will still 
remove them okay the only special character that is allowed is an underscore all the others including the plus the equals the percent the dollar sign the hash all of them will be stripped that's it for now let's meet in this next lesson whereby we are going to validate the email using javascript